do it in your head. So the main important thing was we have this this trinomial minus this other trinomial, okay? Mm -hmm. And just like when we were doing um, other numbers, if I did like five minus four, remember when you like first learned it, you could do like five minus four and we did it vertically, right? That was like kind of two different ways you learned how to do it. Mm -hmm. Well, we kind of stopped doing the vertical way once you like learned it, right? And you just kind of went to this and we're like, oh, we can do it in our head. Well, when we're doing monomials, all right, I'm gonna show you two different ways how to do this. but. The first way that I like, want to show you is just to set it up vertically and to make and make sure that you have them aligned because remember, I can only subtract like terms. An m squared, I can only subtract from an m squared. Mm -hmm. An m, I can only subtract. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to rewrite this problem with it written vertically. And that's just going to help me see this problem in the right light. So remember, this is minus all these terms. So you just make a nice little bar. So just say it out loud as you do it. 4m squared minus 6m squared is a negative 2m squared. Right. Negative 6m minus positive 3m is a negative 9m. And 5 minus a negative 1 is a double negative, which is going to give you a positive 7. Okay? Yep. Now, let's say that doesn't really work for you. You're like, ah, eh, I don't really like that method. Okay? I don't really like subtracting them, bound to make mistakes. Well, the other rule that I can tell you is you can say 5 minus 4, rather than writing 5 minus 4, you could write it as 5 plus a negative 4, correct? Mm -hmm. So what I can do is I can also write this as an addition, addition problem. I can write this as 4m squared minus 6m plus 5 plus, and I'm going to change this to a plus, and I'm going to make this the subtraction of all these numbers, negative 6m squared minus 3m plus one. Now, I'm still gonna do the vertical method, but now I can add. And usually this method is preferred, so you're not gonna be making as many mistakes because most of us don't make as many mistakes with addition as we do with subtraction. Mm -hmm. So now you just add 4m squared plus a negative m squared, negative 2m squared, negative 6m plus negative 3m, negative 9m, five plus one is, um, 5 plus 1 is 6. Why am I getting different answers? What did I do? Oh, one, 5 minus negative 1 is 6. I don't know why I wrote that wrong here. And then this one becomes 6 too, right? Yep. There you go.